Okay, we're going to be trying Trackmania on Amazon Luna. This was a very recently added game, it just got added to the library a few days ago. So it's been released uh, on uh, consoles and cloud gaming platforms. This was actually released on PC in 2020, quite a while ago. But just recently it's become available for Amazon Luna and it's a completely free game. So all you have to do is add it to your Ubisoft Connect library. You don't need Ubisoft Connect Plus which I was a bit confused about. I thought you needed Ubisoft Connect Plus to play this, but all you need is an Amazon Prime subscription and you should be able to play it. So it's gonna be through Ubisoft Connect. One thing I miss about Stadia was the fact that you could actually log into a game without needing to go through the launcher. But it looks like it's pretty quick. How quickly it loads up the game is pretty good. So it looks a bit blurry, the text and stuff. Um, I hope it's running at 1080p. But we'll see how the gameplay looks anyway. Press any button to start. Press any button to start. Accessibility. You will be able to modify these features later in the settings page. It looks like a very fast paced game, but like you get the very high speed sensation. So a lot of the features are actually locked behind Starter Edition. I think you do need to purchase Starter Edition if you want to play like custom games and stuff, probably. Drive alone. Ooh. 
wow, it feels so fast. It's amazing the sensational speed that you get. Not a lot of racing games do this uh, very well nowadays. Like the sensational speed. Which is really important. Okay, how do I... Uh... <laughs> how do I resurrect? Space. How do I change camera? Okay, uh, I don't think you can. But I like that it's quite a simplistic racer. A lot of these racing games nowadays, like Forza Horizon way too complex for me, like, um, not complex, but I hate how much they try to to be cool and like trendy with the, with the generation, the young generation. But this seems, you know, more light-hearted. Oops. It's actually quite difficult, this game. Um, you're going so fast and you can actually end up not, not being able to uh, land properly oh come on this is really hard actually I'm just going to try and take this one slowly. Like that. Whoa. <laughs> you actually go so fast on this thing. On this turbo thing. I was thinking of getting the Amazon Luna controller because it's actually on discount at the moment. It's £40. It really is quite expensive for a controller. I hope that they increase the video quality of Luna. Bronze, not bad.
think a game like this would be probably better with a Amazon Luna controller. But it's uh, it's great to see Amazon Luna expanding pretty pretty well. They recently added Fortnite as well. I think the best looking game I've ever seen on Luna is the the other racing game, the arcade style one. I've got the name of it, but that looks really good. Like it looks, you can't really tell that it's a uh, streaming. It almost looks 4K. Uh, the other racing game, I can't remember remember the name of it, but it was on Prime. It came free with Prime. Uh, for a month, but, but it's uh, it's not in the library anymore, unless you get Amazon Luna Plus subscription. But yeah, worth checking this game out if you have an Amazon Luna or Amazon Prime subscription. Hope this video was interesting. Uh, video quality is good overall, but it could be better. A bit sharper, I hope they add 4K or 1440p. Uh, but thanks for watching. Let me know if you'd like me to test any specific game on Amazon Luna.